Alright then guys, so welcome to the Riptide mission uh, of Destiny 2. Um, right, just completed the Hope mission. Now that we've reached the control center, we still need to power up the place before we can take care of our fleet. Commander Zavala tells me you've volunteered. I'll run tactical. Shipwright Holiday here will provide tech support. It's a straightforward op. Get in, flip a switch, get out. Sloan's got a way of making things sound easy, doesn't she? in this mission. Um, we've got to go over to the, uh, the generators that you can see over there and we have to actually power them up and uh, get them running again. So we're just going to make our way over there. We're just going to keep fighting our way across here. So this place was actually almost completely taken over by the hive um, and pretty much what we're doing at a minute is trying to clear them out and uh, get the generators back online. Um, you guys probably, if you're watching this, you've just watched the, uh, you've just watched the, um, probably just watched the Hope mission. Um, we're now on, of course, the, the Riptide mission, which uh, follows straight on from from that mission. Slow, Amanda. The Hive have infected everything. Holiday, we gotta get you back in the air. We'll need ongoing aerial threat assessments to keep our perimeter secure. Oh, uh, yeah. You know my ship took a beating during the evacuation. I'll bump you to the front of the line for repairs once the lights are back on. Great.
wave energy converters from here. Sweet. Now just flip the switch and turn them on. Accessing systems now. Some of the pistons are moving, but we're still sitting in the dark. Something went wrong. Pistons must be jammed. Sorry, pal. But you're gonna have to go out there. Bring a workaround. Right, so we've just got to go down onto the uh, platforms under here. And we're just making our way through now. Uh, of course, watch out for those mines uh, because they are everywhere. So just going to keep moving through now and uh, take these guys out. Alright, so for this book we're going to switch over to a sniper rifle. Um, does less damage, but uh, it's more precise over a long distance of course, so a bit more useful for us. And we're just going to quickly put on our more powerful equipment. So we haven't actually got any ammo for our um, 
worth them in a minute, but we'll just have to keep moving through and hope that we get some. So, keep an eye out for the, uh, the shanks. Um, they will, of course, do a lot of damage really quite easily. Um, so it's always a good idea to keep an eye out for those, uh, make sure that they aren't flying around because they can really ruin your day. Right, so that's uh, those guys dealt with. Did you hear that? Made it to the converter platforms. Okay. Get to the stalled pistons. See what's jamming. Once they're all looked in, we're in business. Right, so we just need to go across here. Sometimes you'll be able to make that in one uh, jump. Other times... Uh, as you guys can tell there, it's not necessarily possible. Um, but yeah, so if you just keep making your way up here, yeah, and uh, we'll keep moving through, we'll see what we can find. Right, so we just need to now make our way across these uh, platforms off this edge.
so we'll just uh, keep moving through, picking up anything we find. And getting rid of these guys. So we just have to keep making our way across here. And uh, now just as you get up here, of course you get all these guys are spawning. Just move in and take them out and should be all good to go. Now I've noticed that in Destiny 2 a lot of the grenades appear to have sort of a, a pull effect on them. Uh, where they, they sort of they'll pull things towards them um, and it, it stops a lot of the enemies moving away from your grenades uh, you'll quite often notice that if you uh, if you play the game a lot Final piston is clear. Control center still dark so it's got to be more than a piston problem have to get in and butt with the circuit breakers. Try the central platform. Everything routes through there. Right, so we've just got to keep moving across here. And there we go. Hi guys, so that was the Riptide mission. Um, so we've done that now. Uh, we've just got to pretty much make our way to Titan, uh, which of course is where we're going to get thrown out to um, when we actually finish the mission, when we get respawned in. says there's tech that can do the job in the arcology, which is effectively hostile territory. You'd be going in blind. The place has been dark for centuries. All we know for sure is the hive is raising hell down there, perhaps literally. But if you're in, let's put the plan into action. Hey. Good luck, warlock. 